It's fall down Friday. Don't breathe. Inflation might be easing. And Meta lays off 16%. Arbitrage News Daily starts right now. Good morning, traders. Here's your Arbitrage News Daily for Friday, November 11, 2022. I'm Joshua Stark. Price increases moderated in the United States last month and the latest sign that the inflation pressures that have gripped the nation might be easing as the economy slows and Americans grow more cautious. Consumer inflation reached 7.7% in October from a year earlier and 0.4% from September. The government said Thursday the year-over-year increase down from 8.2% in September was the smallest rise since January. The numbers were all lower than economists had expected. More after this on Arbitrage News Daily, including your fall down Friday. To protect his home and family from disaster, Steve used courage, wisdom, and his camera phone. That should do it. Way to go, Steve! By simply taking digital pictures of his family's important documents, Steve can always have them stored safely online, no matter when disaster strikes. Learn other simple ways to protect your home and family before a natural disaster at ready.gov. That's ready.gov. A message from FEMA and the Ad Council. Facebook parent Meta is laying off 11,000 people, about 13% of its workforce, as it contends with faltering revenue and broader tech industry woes, CEO Mark Zuckerberg said in a letter to employees Wednesday. The job cuts come just after a week after widespread layoffs at Twitter under its new owner, billionaire Elon Musk. There have been numerous job cuts at other tech companies that hired rapidly during the pandemic. Zuckerberg said that he had made the decision to hire aggressively, anticipating rapid growth even after the pandemic lockdowns ended. Your Fall Down Friday focus provides enterprise asset performance management, asset performance monitoring, and asset optimization solutions worldwide. Aspen Technology, symbol AZPN, starts at 223.21, but it won't be there for long. Back after this. We're all doing a lot. A lot of swiping, streaming, scrolling, double tapping, and social media stalking. A whole lot of nothing. You're probably scrolling right now. While we think a certain red heart is giving us life, we're neglecting the one that actually does. So let's take a stand against sitting. Let's care more about strolling than scrolling. Let's take charge of our health. Let's make moves together, starting now. I mean, now. Okay, the answer to our riddle yesterday, a limo driver is going the wrong way down a one-way street. He goes past four police officers along the way, yet none of them stop him. One even smiled and waved. Why didn't the police stop him? Because the limo driver was walking, not driving. Yeah, I know. Wasn't expecting that one, were you? We'll see you tomorrow for Arbitrage Weekend, where we'll talk more about the events of the week. See you then. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is a privately held market research company. Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, is solely responsible for the preparation and distribution of the content of this podcast. The opinions offered in this podcast are for informational purposes only and are not intended to be investment advice. Seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. For more information about the informational research and services offered by Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, please visit arbitragetrade.com.